Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss ID and a class selector in the CSS. But before starting with ID and class, let's refresh the last session. In the last session, we have used element as a target or a selector. We have used H1 or any other tag. We can use P, we can use input tag, we can use any kind of tag to select the uh, particular element and we have specified the properties or declaration to that particular element in other words selector now we are going to use some other kinds of selector which first we are going to use id selector the id selector is used to specify a style for a single and unique element in the page the first rule to use id selector that that particular element must be single and a unique inside that particular page the id selector uses the id attribute of the html element we supposed to specify the id to that particular element in html and in css we are defining it with has for example we are using style to rule below will be applied to the element with the id para1 inside the html you supposed to specify attribute id to that particular element where you want to specify the css for example this is our html page and there are many h1 tags there are two here two h1 tags and we only want to specify the css property to the first element now if we are using a element targeting and we are using h1 as a selector in that particular case all the properties we are writing inside that particular selector will be applied to the both h1s but what i want is i want to specify the element uh, attributes of the css to that particular h1 the first one so what we need to do we need to specify id to that particular element and after specifying id to that particular element we supposed to write css for that and as we already know here in the previous session we have specified h1 over here because we want to target all the h1s but in this particular case we want to specify our property color blue to only the first element this one so i cannot use h1 here otherwise both the h1 will be colored blue so what i need to do i need to specify id attribute to this particular element and specify the name of the id in our case it is para1 and in css we supposed to write has to uh, specify that whatever we are writing after has is having id inside the html so has para1 will be colored blue so the first element only will be colored blue and second will be default so this is id but we cannot specify same id to two elements in particular page so this is the id selector we supposed to specify attribute id in html and in css we supposed to sep uh, separate uh, start with the has second is a class selector uh, for example i want to specify same property to uh, more than one elements i definitely cannot use id in that particular case because id should be single and unique it is something like your enrollment number or roll number which is unique in this particular case for example i want to specify some properties to single student at this particular case i should use id for example h1 id equal to 101 so i want to specify some properties to only roll number 101 and in here it would be id equal to 102 because ids cannot be same in two different elements but if we want to specify same properties to more than one uh, elements then we can use class selector it is for the group of elements for example 
we can specify your class as a cx or cy so same class can be applied to more than one elements because it is a group of elements and in html we can, we need to specify class attribute to define the class of that particular element and in css we will denote it with dot we'll start the class name with dot let's see an example same example is there h1 instead of specifying id over here i'm specifying class attribute and defining a value to that is my class same i'm having a, another h1 element which is having same class my class because class can be more than one I cannot use ID over here because if I specify ID same ID to two different element it won't work so what I am doing is I am specifying class over here and equivalent CSS code just we need to change here instead of has I am writing dot which specifies that the after whatever I am writing after the dot is having a class inside the HTML so first and the last would be colored blue and the middle one one uh, will be having a default color which is black okay let's see an example how we can use these uh, selectors so in our last sessions program only which we have targeted in h1 all the h1s i want to target but now i don't want to target all the h1s in this particular case arjun bala and darshan institute of engineering and technology both will be colored red but i only want to color darshan institute of engineering and technology to be red i don't want arjun bala to be colored as a red so what i can do i can specify id attribute to the element which we want to uh, specify properties for example college name i am specifying id to this particular h1 as a college name and instead of writing h1 what i can do i need to specify the name of the id but if i don't i, I simply write college name here what browser will do browser will find the tag name college name it will find here is there any college name uh, at, uh, element inside the html and it won't it won't find anything so we need to separate these with h1 and how i can do that i can specify has over here which specifies whatever i am writing after the has is having a id somewhere inside the page and i want that particular element to be colored red and font size 30 so in this particular case only darshan institute of engineering and technology will be colored red and not arjun bala because we haven't specified h1 here we are only targeting this particular element so this is id for example i am writing one more tag in this particular case i'm writing a paragraph for that for example i am writing some para inside the parameter paragraph i'm writing one br tag just to separate to write in a new line i'm writing my code so as we have already know that id must be single inside the page as i already mentioned id should not be duplicate but in the most of the browsers it will still work if we specify same id to different elements and specifying css for that it will work but you should not use this technique ready it will work but it is not recommended to use same id for the multiple elements instead of that if we want to specify same properties to different elements we can use class instead of id what i am using a class because i want to specify same properties 
to the group of elements not a single element again id will work in the most of the browsers but it is not recommended if if you know that it will only comes once in the page then you can use id otherwise what i recommend is you use class so i am specifying class over here and if i refresh the page css property will not be applied why because i am specified as uh, the college name as a class to that particular elements and if i am specifying class to that uh, a class attribute to the elements i have to write dot instead of has dot is for id sorry has is for id and dot is for the class if i am specifying dot college name what browser will interpret it will find the uh, class uh, elements which is having a class as a college name and specifying this property to the all the elements as we already seen here h1 it is h1 the first is h1 element second is a paragraph but it doesn't matter because both are having same class and we have specified property to that particular class not an element and the output is it will be colored and font size will be increased okay so this is this was id and a class selector inside the css thank you